going guys? Well, we are now a couple days in Germany and everything looks a little bit dreary like you can see back there. It's rainy. Yeah. And we got not too much luck with weather in general. When we was in Hawaii, it rained. Now we're in Germany, it rained. At least it's not snowing. Um, yeah, but in general we are not lucky. Yeah. You were sick for how long? Uh, not that long. Not that long. Don't four days. Me. You had to do your hair. <laughs> four, four days or something like that. Oh, yeah. So we did not do much. So we didn't make any videos because of that. And also we was like ice skating. Ice skating was kind of cool, but I never made a video, but I maybe show a clip. And it was cool. We had a whole ice hall for rink. us. Yeah. The rink. Rink. I, rink. Yeah, we had the whole ring for us and it was actually really nice. Now we get our sports section. And now we try to catch a train and then rent a car and visit a friend and that will be one of our highlights. And after that we go to Cologne and I'm really excited about that. I'm really excited too. Yeah. And we will yeah, make a little documentary about how it is to rent as an American a car in Germany. What do you need? How much kind of co will it cost? And when it's worth it. Yeah. One of the things that is also untypical is that we can now return the car in a different city and that's why we actually want to do it. So we rent it in Fulda and drive then to Cologne. And that, that's also a reason why we choose I look dumb. No, uh, you gotta restart that. <laughs> Um, there are points where you can't go 
infinite amount. And there, are, there are signs to keep in mind. It's usually around cities where they'll, or construction, will they'll bring it down to 120, 90, 80 kilometers per hour. So just kind of keep in mind, keep in traffic. And um, get out of the way if you see someone coming really fast from behind yeah. or go faster. Check the left mirror in the back. They're a fast car. So it's, yeah. Whoa, he was fast. He was fast. He's he can go fast. real fast. He was real fast. <laughs> <laughs> that was so getting the car to Germany as an American isn't that hard. However, however, you just need to let, know how to drive stick shift or prepare to pay the price. Yeah, if you have four people, it's actually really cheap if you can mm -hmm. split the cost. And if you drive to two cities and you have a you have a trip planned, renting a car is always cheaper than actually driving everywhere with the train. Train yeah. actually is it's worth it, but mm -hmm. just for one one time experience. Yeah. This is when you can put the extra on. visited our friend in Braunschweig and so now we're in Cologne and we're about to drop it off. We have about 40 minutes to get to somewhere five minutes away. So perfect. Um, we filled up the gas tank. That was kind of an adventure. Um, <laughs> it he, he, also really need to, he also really needed to go to the bathroom. So, um, but yay, we're here. We made it. Success. Oh. 